you know what, man? I want to be mad, but at the same time, I'm not. Because, let's be real here, I was already imagining my disappointment coming into this game. I thought we actu actually had a shot, but... Let's be real here, we want to get past Kansas City. Um, Kansas City and the, um, and the Ravens. Let's be real here. Okay, first order of business getting to the offseason. Uh, get Mohamed Sanu out of here, because, let's be honest, that dude's freaking trash. Um... And I want to be mad, but the one guy I'm really mad at is Julian Elman. How do you drop up that pass, man? Look, Julian Elman, I love, I love you on this team. I love that you're a receiver on this team, but you got to make that catch, man. And usually on a regular game, bro, I would have been throwing stuff, man. But at the same, but it's whatever, man. Oh, sorry. Sorry if, sorry if you see this white thing coming up. My um, phone battery is... Um, it's at fifteen percent, so my apologies. Um, you know, man, and I have a lot of concern coming into this off season. I honestly don't think Brady's leaving, but you never know, man. Off season gets crazy. Um, Bill Belichick, th do thanks for doing a great job on trying to get Brady out of there, man. Um. You did everything well. You did everything that you wanted to do. I hope you feel freaking proud of yourself. And... You know what, man? After the Miami loss, I said, alright, it's over. But I had to think bigger, man. I had to think bigger than everything. And guess what? You know what, man? I The thing is, I still had faith in this team coming into the playoffs. I thought playoff Brady, playoff Julian Elman, playoff, well, Jules, playoff Jules was going to come alive, but instead, I get embarrassed. <sighs> but, you know, throwing st I've learned from throwing stuff, I've learned not to take things too seriously, but I'm just... I want to be bet. I'm not mad, but that doesn't mean I'm not disappointed. I'm just all right. Hold on, real quick, guys. Let me let me plug you in. Let me plug my phone battery in. I swear this this gets stupid every time. Yeah, um, it's right down there. The thing is, man. I want to be mad, but you gotta. I gotta think bigger than that. You can't. I can't. You know. Be mad at their success, that they've won six Super Bowls, that Brady's a three-time MVP, that he's a comeback player of the year, he's gone to many Pro Bowls. I can't be mad at that. But at the same time, it's frustrating to get eliminated into the playoffs. It's really frustrating. And Monday, for, Monday at school for me, Monday um, at school is going to be... It's gonna be freaking hell for me because most of the most of my friends I know are Patriots haters, as you can imagine, and they're gonna be talking all kinds of smack, talking about this and that. But when they talk crap about my team, their team's not even in the playoffs. And even if they are, let's be honest, they're not getting past Baltimore. Um, I hope, um, 55, Super Bowl 55, I hope we get to there. I hope, I really hope that they build talent around Brady, man, because it's freaking stupid how you bring, Edelman's still here, you bring back Josh Gordon, you bring in Antonio Brown, probably one of the best wide receivers of this, of the last, de of the decade, well, it's 2020 now, oh, happy late New Year, um, and you also have Demarius Thomas, and you just, only one of those guys are still there. Oh, what's next? You're going to throw Julian Elman out too? You might as well, because considering he dropped that pass when he should have caught it. And I kept watching downstairs. We were down 14-13. And I'm like, we only have to get in the field goal range. Oh, no way. We can't do that because we can't do anything on offense. Then you got... um.
Then, um, sorry, sorry if I'm getting off track. Then you have, um, oh crap, what was I saying? Okay, moving on. Um, actually, there was this one play where, now, this is an ongoing thing for the Patriots during this season. And I want to tell you what it is. It happened week 16 against Buffalo. There's a big play that happens. Um, there's always this big play that um, happens. There's this big play that happened. Uh, Brady threw a long, kind of a sloppy pass to Benjamin Watson that was a first down. Oh, hold on. There's more to this. Beep. Holding. Offense. We can't have a good play without getting called for a penalty. It's not possible. When we have a good play, we can't have a good play without getting called for like an offensive uh, penalty. It's it's impossible. It's legit impossible. And oh my freaking god, bro! I just I just don't understand that they have guys. Brady has guys he could throw to, but he can't. But the guys can't even complete a pass. They can't even get open. I don't understand. And let me get on Tom Brady real quick. Why is Tom always throwing in the double coverage? One time he was throwing uh he was throwing a ball. He was trying to get Mohamed Sanu, but he, there was two guys around. I guarantee he's like Edelman or James White was somebody somebody was open. Why are you throwing in the double coverage? You guys this team was falling in love with the pass too much. Oh man, um, oh snap, oh, I don't understand this team, I just, I don't, it's actually frustrating if you think about it, it's really frustrating to the fact that you went from Antonio Brown and all those superstar wide receivers to getting beat by a 4-11 and 9-7 and and team. In teams, well, t at least Tennessee is good. You should you should have never lost to Miami. I don't. And here come all the haters. Oh, the up the dynasty's over. Thank God we've been waiting for this day forever. Might as well be the end of this dynasty, man. Hey, hashtag tank tank for Trevor's Lawrence. Trevor Trevor Lawrence, man. Well, uh, go Pats Nation, man. Um. A regular uh, fan, when they see their team lose, they're like, oh, I'm, I'm done with this team. I'm still sticking with this team, man. But it's still frustrating. And you can't call me a crybaby, man. I'm taking this L like a man. I'm taking this L like a man. But it's whatever, man. It's whatever. So, um, hashtag go Patch Nation. Um. I will be watching the rest of the NFL playoffs. Um, gosh, sure hope that's exciting. Um, yeah, peace out, guys. See you guys in the next video. Bye.